Today I'm going to show you how to install a wireless card into a computer that just doesn't have internet. Uh, this will give the computer access to Wi-Fi and Bluetooth as well. So I'm just going to go ahead and install it really easy. Technically it's a two-parter. You have to install this little part and then you have to screw in the antennas on the back so it can actually get a good signal. They usually all come in an anti-static bag so that you don't break it. As you can see here, here's the part. Here's the little wireless guy. This is the antennas we screwed into. This goes into your board. All right, so let's see right here. Just kind of match up the points. It's not rocket science. All you have to do is match it up, align it, and push it in. So we'll go ahead and do that. Oh, you see we got a great alignment right there. You're not going to hear a click. Not really. Sometimes you might. Uh, so you'll just need to also attach to the motherboard a little USB part. Um, at least for this one. You just have to align it in the back. Yeah, all right. It'll feel, it'll depress in just a little bit. All right, now where is this gonna go? Right there. So we'll put, we'll connect it easily right there to right there. It says USB. Tight. The bad thing about computers is you either get it or you don't. All right. So I had to press a little hard to put it in, but it's all good to go. So, as you can see with our wire, we're just going to tuck it down here through the sleeve in the open case. Right through here. For our no-show cable look. Alright, now let's find the little connectors. This will sit on the desk in the back. Act as a little bit of a Wi-Fi receiver. That way your computer doesn't have to try too hard. Uh, these don't particularly go on any specific spot in the back, just unless it says otherwise, we just screw it in however it is. Hmm. Sorry, we're distracting me. Alright, hold on. Alright, and now you boot it on, and you'll have internet.